Welcome back everyone. It's about 1 2 o'clock in the afternoon now. Back at my wild camp location. I really like this spot. I did bring in the 10 by 10 Aqua Quest and there's not much of a footprint to lay that out in plow point. I got her figured out and I think I have a flat spot to sleep for the night. It's been a great afternoon out here. Had a bit of a snack for lunch. Getting a little hungry again. I'm probably gonna munch on something. Yeah, enjoy this view. It is just peaceful out here. Buggy. Got a pretty good plan for dinner tonight, if it all turns out, but <laughs> I think it will. Be cooking on my Oatsy Titanium. Got a new stove. Really excited about that. Should be a lot of fun to cook on. And it's considerably lighter than the carbon I had. Like, considerably. All the gear today came in a brand new Bushcraft Rock by Spruce Outdoor. I did help design this. It was a lot of fun. This is just the prototype. We'll be taking a closer look at this in a little bit. For now, I'm going to enjoy one of these and uh, let's relax for a little bit. Well, we're pushing about four o'clock. I'm getting a little famished. I brought in a new stove. Uh, you've seen me cook on an Oatsy before, but that was the carbon. This is the Oatsy Titanium, their lightest model. This thing is awesome. I haven't lit a fire in it yet or cooked anything on it, so this is going to be a treat for everyone. Some AAA Canadian beef sandwich steaks. They're real thin, really big. I got a really good plan for these. There's one, two, three, four of them. Yeah, that'll be a feast. I was testing out this new pack, so I loaded it up. I skimped out on gear for this trip, but went full on for food. <laughs> I'm happy. I'm gonna flame grill the steaks on the Oatsy flat pack. I got some tortillas. The salsa that comes with the taco kit, taco seasoning. Don't know how I'm gonna use that or if I'm going to. A tomato, an onion, and some romaine lettuce. So I'm gonna do steak tacos while sitting by this beautiful lake on the Oatsy stove. I gotta go collect some firewood for the stove and get dinner going. I did have a plan to film this review in the back country in the Monashi Mountains. Unfortunately, a long wet spring led to all the bridges being washed out and rock and mudslides on all my back country hiking roads. So I have zero access to the Monashi Mountains, which is unfortunate. So out here today to finally give this thing a test run. I'll be taking this thing with me everywhere. These grills work really well. I'll provide a link in the description of this video if you want to check them out. I highly suggest you do. Oatsy's team's amazing and their products are top notch. I'm gonna let this burn down a little, get a good bed of coals and get grilling some meat. I'm really excited. Oatsy makes some amazing products. These grills are probably one of my favorite thing to cook on. And now that I have the lightweight titanium, man, this thing will be going with me a lot and far and wide. <laughs> I'm gonna use the griddle plate underneath this bag as my chopping board. Cause I have no plate, no nothing. Uh, how do I wanna cut this tomato?
kind of mangling it, but I'm in the bush. Doesn't matter. All right, there's the tomato. Oh no. That sucks. Bound to happen. Looks like I'm eating a little dirt. I didn't really think this through. <laughs> <laughs> like at all. I don't care. I like onion. I don't care if it's cut big. Well, I think it's time to get some meat on there. The skewer comes in really handy instead of burning my fingers. Oh, these aren't going to take long to cook at all. Oh, these two are done. Ooh, that's hot. Yeah, those are done. I don't have a table, so I'm just <laughs> using some firewood. Well, let's get these last two on there. And the steaks are grilled. I love these Oatsies and this titanium one's over at the top. I am very impressed. <laughs> Since I have no plate or cutting board, I'll just be eating these one at a time. Got my tortilla. Big slab of meat. Ooh, some aged Tavardi. Onion. Fish jumping. Some tomato. Some salsa. And some romaine lettuce. Oh man. <laughs> mm, that looks good. That looks good. Can't really roll them, which was kind of my thought, but I don't know what to call that. Come up with a name for this thing. 
but it's gonna be good. Mm-hmm. Now that is camping food. It was worth its weight in gold packing it in here because it wasn't light. These Oatsy Grills, man, they give such a good flavor. They're so easy to cook on. And recipes like, I would never have thought of this without the Oatsy Grill. Mm. Having these tortillas out here gave me an idea. I could use the griddle plate and do quesadillas. I could do real good quesadillas. Mm. Next time I'm out with the spark, I'm doing quesadillas, 100%. I'm going to pre-cut up the vegetables, separate them, and just Ziploc bags. Make it a lot easier than filling my tomatoes and onions with dirt. But, eh, a little more protein. <laughs> One down, three to go. I'll get back to you guys in a bit. Well, what do you think of that feast? <laughs> that was pretty good. I'm very impressed with how my Philly cheese steak tacos turned out. Still, that doesn't sound right. But those were delicious. I'm stuffed. Uh, a lot of garbage to pack out with that. And it was a lot of weight to pack in for a meal like that. It's so worth it. Like, I am content. And dessert. <laughs> Why not, eh? Cheers, everyone. Oh, these bugs are bad. I should think about getting this fire going here pretty quick. It's about 6 o'clock. I got an abundance of firewood. So I'm not worried about that at all. Like I can take the tip of this tree off and I got firewood all night long. <laughs> so, yeah, don't have to work too hard there. I like that. Up some, I'm just gonna have to gather up some kindling and there's so much fallen stuff here. It'll be a piece of cake. Yeah, fire a ward off some of these mosquitoes, I hope. They're ugly tonight. No frogs. No frogs yet. Knock on wood, I probably shouldn't have said that. We got loons diving. And really, it's been pretty quiet. Just some birds chirping and lots of mosquitoes buzzing. And yeah, it's been good. It's been a great day out here. And we have fire. I'm out today field testing an all new ruck by Spruce Outdoors. This is their new bushcraft bag. I waited till later in the evening to talk about this. Because I've been using it all day. I've been in and out of all the pockets, using all my gear. It's actually been really functional. It worked out very well. It's made of wax and oiled canvas, 35 liters, all genuine leather, nice solid buckles, stitching's well done. Overall, it's, uh, it's a really nice pack. There's a few things that need to be changed. Axe sleeve is actually more for an Agawa. Uh, an axe handle would not fit in there. So that needs adjusted. Going forward, I'll keep you guys all up to date on the pack and the progress because it's back to the drawing board for a few items. I will be going over this pack in detail from top to bottom in the next video. I'll be sure to leave links in the description of this video for Spruce Outdoor Instagram, Facebook, and website. You should go check them out. They make some nice stuff and a prototype in the works. Well, it's been a pretty amazing day. 
got to test the new pack, got to try my OC titanium. I got my plow point rigged up on a continuous ridge line. It's working really well. Have it tied off in the center back to the ridge line with a prusik and a toggle. Open it up, gave me so much more space inside. Anyways, yeah, I should have enough firewood to get through the night now. I'm, I'm kicked back by this fire. I'm getting eaten by bugs out here, so I need to get back by the heat and the smoke. Get back to you guys in a bit. Last time I was here, I actually left my candle lantern hanging on a tree. And it spent a week out here before I could come get it. So yeah, I'm going to use it again because it's got a citronella candle, but I won't be hanging it from a tree. That was not a smart move. I moved it to cool down and forgot about it. Yeah, fire sure feels good. I'm gonna relax. I think I got some trail mix and some other snacks in my food bag. So probably munch on something and, and enjoy the calmness. The night has officially set in. Kicking back, enjoying my nice hot tea. Uh, some triple berry something. I like the herbal ones. I don't like the caffeine at night, keeps me up. So the herbal's perfect, hits the spot. The moon's making awesome glare off the water. I'm gonna try and get some pictures of that before I go to bed, but yeah, for the most part, I'm just gonna enjoy the rest of this. Kick back, listen to these noisy birds and not listen to frogs. Thanks for watching everyone. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. If you really enjoyed it, hit that subscribe button. I'll catch you next time.